Tonight's starting lineups. For the Suns, they will run out that same starting five that has them playing in another defender. And then they have to load up on Westbrook, especially now with Paul George out. He hasn't shot the ball well. You want to invite the jump shot and not that. And this is exactly known that he wouldn't attack, right? I mean, the guy just plays with energy that I've never seen before on the court. Suns just have to do a better job. They're going to be there all night long and not think he's going to have an easy time of it because of intimidation. Beat inside to eight. Won't get him and quickly on the five. Quickly as Booker eyes the wide open three. Long pass up ahead to Ferguson and Booker was cut. Bridges getting the defensive assignment on Westbrook. I didn't think it was a tech. I think officials are paying attention to guys hanging on the rim. Grant working on the slender bridges. Tapped back away by Adams right into the hands of Grant. That the officials are paying close attention to him. Eight and again as Booker. The rookie of the year. And Luka Doncic is playing out of his mind too. Adams. In. But the Suns unable to corral the loose ball rebound. It's one of the things that Suns have done a terrific job of is Adams again. A guy that's just as big and can run just as fast. He has to get back defensively. E.J. Warren on the quick catch and shoot. Goskop had talked in recent games about getting off to strong starts. He's got to be pleased with this one thus far. Look, wrestle. Melton comes up short on the three. Ferguson quickly leaking out. A quick race to the basket. But Jeremy Grant using that length of his and gets the block. Nader sets up for the corner three. And down he goes. Up and down in the locker room like, oh, yeah. <laughs> Aiden inside another slip tonight in the absence of his teammate Paul George. Like he's trying to go for a triple double at halftime. Warren, four of eight in Orlando. What a nice job thus far here, staying in front of Westbrook. Forces a tough shot, but the turn around there. That's in and out for Devin. Great look. Great hustle back defensively by Booker, though. Gives the Suns a steal. Jackson inside of the reverse. No, but Aiton. It's in a lot of energy to do it because of his advantage above the rim. Grant under the radar as Crawford has it stolen right out of his hands. Schroeder off to Noel. And then an easy slam. Gets the basketball. You know he's going to make a definitive move. Here's Raymond Felton, who has seen his playing time diminish. Yeah, I feel like he's playing a little strike him out, you know, against the brick wall when you throw that fastball. Crawford, how about the delivery here for the Thunder at eight? Now you can just see the activity that Oklahoma City has defensively. And I hope tonight he continues to want to be outside. Because I think he's a low inside. Jackson with a quick pull. The few mistakes that Westbrook has made in a very productive first half. Jackson eyeing the three, and look, Oklahoma City is trying to go on the attack. Jackson on the spin, inside, block. He elevates on Westbrook has it smothered there by the rookie Bridges. Up ahead to Oubre, and Adams won't catch up. Sons a chance to take the lead to Holmes. Inside, slams it. Dribble, no one was around him. Russell Westbrook inside, blocked away again. Grant. Jackson just missed some of the top teams, the, the glue guys, as they are called. And Jeremy Grant is most definitely a glue guy. Devin Booker, a little too strong and high on that one. Jeremy Grant runs the floor. But the, problem, the, the part here is they're growing, they're learning, and they're starting to enjoy the game of back. For OKC. Shooter with his head down. And Adams with an easy chance. These young guys to at least have some fun, to feel like they're doing something and give them some confidence. But Aiton says no. Aiton already flirting with another double-double. He's got 10 and 7. Booker, right past Grant. Since that time, he is 2 of 6. He's also got 6 turnovers, and that has been part of the problem. Is nice, soft touch. Bridges getting help as Aiton stands his ground. And Grant and Bridges both taking a tumble. DJ Warren. Schroeder getting the start tonight in the absence of Paul George and Westbrook. So Westbrook who just missed his 10. And 
Bridges fires across the corner to Melton. Bridges gets it back and loads up for triple opportunity. Yeah, this is the one thing the Suns cannot allow to start to happen. They have an advantage in the way they're shooting the ball. Yes, at them. <laughs> Westbrook on the attack. Left hand, yes. Any points that he gets, kind of consider gravy. Nader hits the open look. Now, he elevated right with them. Abdul Nader checking in at 6-6. Schroeder on the drive, and shot clock winding down. Booker with a step back over Nader. The ring is Schroeder miss. Schroeder's really struggled in this game, and that's really good for the Sun. Josh Jackson, a little coast to coast. Close. No. I feel like Westbrook has gone backwards. He had the great rhythm early. Warren with the spin and puts it up and in. He just got too much stuff. Westbrook. Westbrook handing it off to Nader, who continues to build on his career high. Ayton swipes the rebound. Up ahead to Warren. Warren gets it. Jackson holding his ground, but Grant's himself in space. He likes to hit people. Had one start last year, got his 31st tonight. Last meeting. This will be the final meeting of the regular season between these two teams. Westbrook gets inside somehow. No, I don't have to run up and down the court. <laughs> well, there's that too. Grant. You know, you, you can't fault it. You can criticize it at times without a doubt. T.J. Warren says. Got 11 in the quarter. Looking to add to it. But they pick his pocket. Here comes Felton. And Felton racing. Sons kind of a little disconnect offensively here as Crawford able to get inside. Little chip. Final three seconds. Shooter going at Holmes and Holmes. Oh! Tough break. Schroeder able to get in. Schroeder with a mid-range pull-up. Gets the roll. One. Crawford going to work against Noel again. With a step back. And that, okay, take this one. <laughs> Noel reaching. Told to reach in the bucket. A Schroeder. Dubre going to work on Noel, gets inside the left hand, and Noel. The Thunder made some adjustments after that because Aiden was just getting dunked after dunk. But catch and shoot with the catch. I, mean, I know he was a little bit off balance. He has his foot down, footwork down. He's got to take that one. Shooters hit one there. Offensive rebound, Patterson. He wanted to take that shot again. Adams rolls. Oubre. The Suns have gone ice cold from the field. Drop off pass to Diallo, who runs it out and slams it down. That will Billy Oubre back off the bench as Nader was able to snake along the baseline. Loose ball into the hands of Grant. Westbrook. Well, I mean, so an NBA game is never done. The Suns are going to have to get it done on the defensive end as well. Westbrook. The Suns not in a position to trade baskets. His Booker on the drive. And Booker with a scoring 47 left in this game. A lot of time for a run. Trying to add to it, and he's to blame for trying to get the triple double, right? So, right. Bridges for the corner three. Down it goes. Preston, as a result, will pick up their 22nd win as Russ. Stan played terrific basketball for three quarters. And how about the night from Abdul Nader's game as Russell Westbrook? Those 18 points was huge. Tough for the night for Phoenix as they fall here to the Oklahoma City Thunder, 118 to 102. Special thanks to our fabulous crew, as always. Our next Suns broadcast coming up, Fox Sports Arizona Plus tomorrow as the Suns play host to the Western Conference leading Denver Nuggets. Suns live coverage.